Hey, it's Sifu David here, and today we're going to show you the three basic Wing Chun self-defense moves for beginners. So these are very simple, basic moves that you must know if you want to learn self-defense and Wing Chun. So stay tuned, here we go. And yes, we are giving away these free DVDs, Accelerated Wing Chun System Quick Start DVD, normally retailing for 129 bucks. But enter the contest. All you need to do is to subscribe, click the notification bell, and like and comment on this video, and you'll enter automatically into the draw. Every week, we're gonna give away a free video. So, good luck. Here's the first technique. It's the Tan Da. What am I doing? I'm doing a Tan style, right? Time so going to 11 o'clock. All right, so if I'm going straight on, 11 o'clock. If I'm blocking this way, it's gonna go one o'clock. So from the back, 11 o'clock and one o'clock. That's the angle of the time so. So if I'm facing him, so coming, boom, I wanna go 11 o'clock. And then my index finger is pointing over there. And then my elbow is low. So I have structure here. You can push as hard as you want. Okay, how much can you bench? Um. Oh, 300, 300. 300 pounds you can bench. And he's, are you putting all your weight right now? Yeah. He's putting all his weight in and I can support myself. I can, I'm solely relaxed and I can support it because I have structure, okay? So this is what the tan cell is good for, you have structure. So he's coming in, tan da, because I'm using the tan and the da, which means a hit. So this could be hit to the face here or palm in the face, okay? So that's the first one. It's called tan da, it's good against hooks. Even if it does more, multiple hooks, boom, boom, okay? I've got two in there already. All right, so that's the first technique. Stay tuned, let's do the second basic Wing Chun technique that you must know. Here is the second basic Wing Chun self-defense technique that you must know. It's called the Pak Da. So what I'm doing is the Pak Sao. Pak Sao, 45 degrees that way. So it redirects his punch. His punch is going straight to my face, right? If I don't get it out of the way, it's gonna punch my face. So he's gonna punch. Okay, boom, and I go 45 degrees that way with my pop saw. 45 degrees, 45 degrees, 45 degrees. Okay, that's the angle. Okay, so if I'm just coming, boom, 45 degrees. At the same time, I'm gonna do a da, it's a hit underneath. So at the same time, this one will 45, this one goes straight. This one's over, this one's under. Okay, he's coming in, boom. This is gonna hit him in the face, redirect this, this goes in the face, okay? So that is the pop da. You can use it on the other side too. Boom. Right, this goes 45. You see how it takes its balance? Okay, you want that. You want to take its balance and also attack at the same time. Okay, so how do you use this? It's like, boom. You can use that one too, cutting punch over top. Or you can use pop cell, like that. After this, push him that way, and then use technique number three, chamber blast. Chain blast. That's technique number three. We'll come back and we'll show you how to use the chain blast. The third basic Wing Chun self-defense technique is this one, the chain blast. So after I do the tan da, boom, 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 it's opened up in the middle, I'm just gonna blast it straight down the middle. Boom, boom, and run away. Okay, that is the chain blast, okay? So, one more time. Okay, chain blast. It's like a suppressive fire with a machine gun. It's very hard for him to block everything. Okay, it's coming so fast. I'm doing it slow even, right? Mm -hmm. So if it's do a little bit faster, right? Okay, so just using palms because I don't want to hurt him, right? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, next one you can do with the same, uh, with the same train blast technique, but now with the pop dot, right? So he's coming with a minute. Boom. <laughs> Okay, so we do that. What did I do? You ready? Right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, slow motion. Okay, I did a pack. It sends him backwards. So now instead of trying to reach over his shoulder, I just hit the ropes here. So boom, boom, and boom, boom, boom. Hit the two spots here. Okay, so I'm hitting like this. I know it doesn't look like Wing Chen because I'm off the center, but why would I hit the center when his shoulder is in the way? Right? I can hit up here and here. So this is my chain blast in two sections, two vulnerable spots. Okay, so those are the three basic self-defense 
Wing Chun techniques that you must know. Awesome, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed these Wing Chun techniques and basic self-defense moves that you must know. If you like this video, click the like button and make a comment, tell us what you think, tell us all the questions that you have, and also subscribe to this channel and click the button and get the notifications of all the awesome lessons that are coming out almost on a daily basis. So I'll see you soon in the next video.